This video shows how a Prophecy sales forecasting software user experiences the software update wizard in the real world. The software update wizard was originally developed to securely support Prophecy updates without customer IT involvement and without the need for the user to have admin rights. Subsequently, the software update wizard was developed as a separate set of components which any Windows software developer can deploy to add automatic updates to their own application with literally a few lines of code and no server-side coding other than a simple text-based script. Before we start up Prophecy, here is a screenshot of the actual C++ code in Prophecy that triggers the update check. The highlighted line is where Prophecy actually initiates the check. It really is as simple as that. So now let's fire up Prophecy and let's load up our default forecasting database. There. Prophecy calls the web update function in the code we've just looked at as it starts up. The software update wizard checks for an update and then shows a user-friendly message to tell the user that there is an update available. There. The user can now choose whether to accept the update at this time. The software update wizard supports optional and non-optional updates. The update script you supply on your web server determines whether the update is optional or non-optional, as well as the message the user sees, the cosmetics of the message boxes and many other facets of the update. So let's just accept the update. The update has been downloaded. The software update wizard now has to close Prophecy in order to update it. Once the update process is completed, the software update wizard will then relaunch Prophecy for the user. The Prophecy executable and the help file have both been updated by the software update wizard. Once this final message has been displayed, the software update wizard restarts the new version of Prophecy. There we are. As painless as updates can be, the data perceptions valued customers.